Tabletop Radio. Woo! -hoo. We did we did day one. We've raised uh, rather a lot of money. Um, and uh, yeah, I am here joined with Ollie, our fabulous RPGs rep. Say hi, Ollie. Hello. Hello. Um, yeah. So we've we've got a a um, wonderful schedule of programming for you today. Uh, let me see if I can get up that. Uh, yeah. Let me see if I can get that up. So just casually doing some OBS shenanigans. Uh, doing OBS shenanigans in the middle of a stream, it's great. I am so, so proud of myself. Um, uh, we're, we are pre very prepared. Nothing ever goes wrong. Everything is amazing. Uh, it is this one. We need a hasty avid. Please remove the... Okay, cool. That is a thing that I've already done, and also I am not in streamer mode, so I hope you heard that Discord notification. Um. <laughs> yes, um, they need, there needs to be uh, a change again, because the, new, the old one before wasn't a slide, and now this one's a slide, and it's all okay. funny. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. We'll copy that. Okay, so now here you can see... Uh, our amazing schedule. Uh, Ollie, if you want to just run through and talk a little bit about like each of the things that we're doing today. Yeah, uh, yeah sure. Um, let me just find exactly which one is the, uh, <laughs> the, the what's it, itinerary. Uh, it shouldn't take very long, but I have to scroll up a bit, okay. as you can probably hear, because my mic's quite sensitive. <laughs> We're we're so we're oh, so prepared on. for this interlude. It is it is unreal. Um, yeah, I love it. Um, <laughs> damn, I just closed my OBS because I didn't think I would need it. Uh, whereas I have that slide on there. It's a, it's okay. It's it's on it's it's on the stream. Uh, so we have. Is it oh, good? <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yeah. So we've got a welcome back now, um, and then we've got the second board game wavelength uh after which there will be another interlude and rainbow paranoia uh which is the second rpg um at six we've got waging war i'm, I'm assuming that's a war game of some description yeah, they're doing um, yeah, uh, it's john our war games rep is hosting some uh it's hosting some x-wing um so yeah look forward to that uh, cool <laughs> so we've got running the nets afterwards um, and then we've got my segment, which will obviously be uh, the best one, objectively, uh, where we talk about game design. Um, and then 5D chess, which I'll also be somewhat involved in, but I'm not entirely sure how. Uh, I've played a lot of chess, but I've never played 5D chess, so that will be an entertaining one as well. Yeah, lovely. So we've got a jam-packed... Jam jam-packed schedule uh for you this this morning uh i'm trying to find the thing uh do that uh save okay cool and then bop 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 copy all right and now we can now another exciting thing is that yesterday we managed to we managed to raise over over one thousand pounds, be beating every every single goal that we set, which is absolutely absolutely insane. Um, so today today we have some new goals. Uh, so you can see on the stream what our new stretch what the new stretch goals that have been added are. Uh, we have at the £1,250 marks, we're going to be prototyping and playing the tabletop radio board game that we made yesterday. Uh, it's going to be on a later stream, not during one of the segments. Uh, that is right. We are going to be making a game uh, which is going to be 
which is which would be amazing. Um, then we are going. Then, at our at our one thousand five hundred mark, we are going to be making the official tabletop radio one page RPG. Yeah, that's right. What what one game was not enough for us. Right, so we decided that we're going to make another game, only this time it's going to be an RPG. Ooh, extremely exciting. Um, and then, and then, in, at the 2000 mark, the 2000 mark, if we, if we ever reach this insane goal, it's going to be absolutely absurd. We can see, we can see the goals being added as I'm speaking on the bar in the bottom right. People, people behind the scenes are doing an excellent job. Um, but if we do get to two thousand, which would be absolutely mind-blowingly insane, like Ares will lead a ring fit stream on the hardest difficulty with everyone suffering along. Uh, like it says there, this is mostly here because we needed a ridiculous goal. But then again, we'd never thought we'd make one thousand. Um, so. Yeah, it's absolutely incredible we managed to raise this amount of money for charity. Um, so I'd like to thank uh, everyone on behalf of the team for donating. Uh, and let's let's keep going, you know, stretch the limits, see how far we can go, uh, get into some of those ridiculous stretch goals if possible. Yeah. Yeah, of course. Yeah. So that is, those are some of the, um, some of the, things that we've got going on today um, yeah we, we are now we are now back to webcam um, and of course of course we've also got some of our donation goals to that we're going to be going through uh, today um, we've we've of course got the makeup stream which is a sneaky sneaky addition that will be happening uh, right before the Netrunner stream today um, yeah, we've also got so we've got that going on, um, and yeah, just generally big excite, get hyped. Um, we've got so we've got a few more, few more minutes of this interlude before um, before code names get set up. So 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 I'll I'll, I'll, ask, I'll ask this question, Ollie. Like, how how are you, how are you how are you feeling today? Like, <laughs> pretty good. I'm excited for the game design segment. I've got some uh, some sneak peeks um, into my yeah. work in progress Ruby unofficial tabletop game. Uh, I've been Ooh. For some time now, um, and I know some of my other panelists have got some insights to share um, with regards to their own adventures in in game design. So I'm looking forward to it. Uh, I'm sure we'll be quite tired by that point, but we'll get through it as best we can. And um, I believe I'm involved in a, a few other interlude segments as well, so you haven't seen the last of me uh, before before that as well. Yeah, yeah, obviously, yeah, obviously, I am quite tired after being being up at like one o'clock last night doing doing the most professional interlude anyone has ever seen. Um, but today we are, yeah, but we're going to be running uh, Rainbow Paranoia today, uh, which is going to be fun and exciting and total chaos. Um, and then, yeah, we've got the makeup stream and Netrunner stream happening later. Those are going to be fun. Be ready for those. Um, and yes, various, various interludes are also, also happening. Um, so yeah. All right, so. What? This isn't the, yeah, it's just, oh, let, let, let's have a, let's have a, let's have a cheeky, a cheeky look at the, at the, um, the actually, yeah, let, let's do a quick reminder of the, into, what's been your favorite segment so far? Oh yes, uh, I think 
I think I quite enjoyed Tabletopoly just because I think that that was um, that was just the perfect blend of like chaos and anarchy and stuff. Uh, Ollie, what would you say that your favourite tabletop stream so far has been? Uh, tuned in for a little bit of the, the yeah. Bob Ross stuff and some of the Jack Ross stuff. Yeah. Um, I was doing uh, my own thing for a decent amount of the day, but I especially enjoyed the Finn Boz uh, kazoo segments as well, um, which were oh. quite good. But yeah, I, I actually oh. should have tuned in for slightly more of tabletop really. Um I got busy sort of halfway through it. That did look quite good as well. I liked a lot of the different <laughs> versions of the places. <laughs> yeah. It's always cool when you have different versions of Monopoly and you find out what they've named each place. So it was, uh, it was you could tell yeah. a lot of effort had gone into all the segments. But um, yeah, I I particularly liked the, um, the, the, the Bob Ross bit uh, for as much of it that I saw. Yeah. And we and while you were talking, we received a we received a donation from Alex Uwu. Uh, we, we yeah the he said yeah he donates five pounds and said Kazowo me Jeffrey Bezos from Inside Plocks Owo. Oh, uh, <laughs> thank you thank you Alex for your your generous your generous donations. Um, one one more thing before I. Yeah, one more thing. Uh, I just t thought I'd take a second to remind people of the donation incentives that we have. Uh, if I can get the image up, uh, doing some OBS stuff. Uh, these were these were also on the slide that I showed you earlier, but I but I thought I'd just uh, take a moment to mention them explicitly. So for any for any amount of money. Uh, you get a shout out on the newsletter. Uh, hooray! Like our excellent Hannah, co op officer, writes newsletters every week, and you'll have an opportunity to get your name in that newsletter for like any amount of money, any amount at all. Uh, but if you go up to the amount of three quid, you get a spin on our infamous wheel. Ooh! Uh, it could be four things, generally. Uh, I think it was. Poke, drawing Pokemon from memory, origami. There, there's some good stuff on there. Uh, for five quid, you get to commission our Fimba for a kazoo tune uh, of a song of your choice. Uh, it's a totally awesome kazoo tune. Always, always appreciate the good pun. Uh, and at seven quid, you get your very own expertly designed RPG item. Uh, from again our excellent co-op officer Hannah um, for eight quid or nine quid you get a karaoke song sung by one of the many people we have during these interludes uh, could be me could be another one of our another one of our ex uh, yeah yeah could be and then but for for eight quid you don't get a song choice but for nine quid you do get a song choice so just that just that little extra pop for donating just that little bit extra um and for 15 you get a spin on our commission roulette wheel so we've got a number of artists uh each of the yeah we've got a number of artists uh each of them yeah some of them we've got varying levels varying levels of um decency but you'll you'll certainly get a piece of art on there um Oh, yeah, and the, it, it, this slide still says the character art commissioned by Ares, um, but that is that has been taken, um, so we do not we do not have any more. Uh, and with that, I think that that is another another successful interlude. Um, I'm seeing, I'm going to see if John is ready. I'm going to switch you over to the slides right now, and we'll head into yes. going into when John is ready. Um, uh, I believe he is. So. I mean, That's yeah. good. Okay, cool. I'll hit, I'll hit slides. Uh, so yeah, stay safe and goodbye. See you soon.